Hey friend, welcome back to part two of my pajama party sleepover prep for grandkids and two of my daughters. I didn't want to overwhelm you by putting all of this in with the first video and have you sitting all this time. So here we are with part two. If you haven't seen part one, make sure you go over and check it out and then come back and check this part out and then, or vice versa. Either way, so I'm just straightening up my office, getting it prepared for, this is gonna be the sleepover room, AKA my guest bedroom suite. Um, and I'm just going to put up two air mattresses. I went and purchased one. I actually need to purchase two more because one of the, uh, the other one that I have actually has a small leak and it has to be blowed up periodically um, throughout the night with whomever it is that one right there the blue one so i really need two more because i could fit two in here comfortably three in here all together um one could go in front of these two anyway so we're gonna just put this up and then i'm gonna make them up and you know all the things and get it comfortable for daughter to spend the night so it was minx and her kids that stayed in this room and then middle daughter and her boy stayed in the den right beside this room. I'm 
definitely eyebrow blonde. <laughs> and I do not care. Primer from Target. We ain't gonna do this too much, y'all, because I gotta be playing with these babies. We ain't gonna do this too much, y'all. I'm just, just in the. Man, you can't put that on. Now, you can't, you can't put it on. Oh, I didn't mean to do that. Ah, that's too much. Look at that. Tacos and fajitas were on the menu for 
tonight's slumber party, sleepover, whatever we're calling it. And I did some charcuterie boards for me and the daughters. We made some drinks and just did all the things. And it was a success. I loved, loved, loved entertaining those grandbabies. And they entertained us, really. We laughed at them so hard at those little fights they was having. The little clicks that was getting formed. I don't even think they watched movies, y'all. I think they just ate junk food all night and played and did all the, the stuff kids like to do. The cousins getting together. Stay tuned because I'm going to have to do this all over again with the other grandkids when their weekend isn't as busy as it was. We'll have an outdoor movie night. I'm already planning that. Um, and it'll probably turn into a sleepover as well. So, yeah. Side note, I really enjoy cutting things up, like chopping. <laughs> I don't know what that is all about, but like prep work, chopping anything. I really freaking enjoy chopping. Yeah, fun fact about me. I like to chop. Yeah, I'm 100% certain that I was a um, a cook in another life. I was either a sous chef or I was the chef. Or hell, I was the prepper. I don't know because I'm in full on enjoyment right now. Just even watching myself cut up these bell peppers. I was enjoying the process, but I'm enjoying watching. <laughs> I had to give you another angle and cut up a green one to go with it because... Yeah. Hey, granddaughter. She just walked in. I'm so happy to see them. They're getting so big, y'all. These memories. I need these memories. And if we're being honest, y'all have watched these babies grow up right alongside of me. Like, y'all are the grandparents, the aunts, the uncles as well. So, we're creating memories here. Grandpa Ron in the building. Mm-hmm. Looking sexy. I love that man, y'all. Um, I'm out here trying to get this griddle um, grease thing emptied up and cleaned up a little bit. We left it open the other day when it rained, and it kind of gave us a little bit of a rust situation. So I got to get that cleaned off because I do want to do the bell peppers and onions out here on the griddle because it's so many, and it'll just be quicker. So, yeah, continue to enjoy the video. Make sure you subscribe to this channel if you haven't already. Make sure you do so. Okay? Because I'm your favorite auntie. Yeah, look at Artie. <laughs> Artie being his own world, doing his own thing. Okay? He don't care if it's 99.999 bodies in here. He don't see none of us, and he ain't fooling with none of us until it's time to fight or eat. Ain't that right, grandson? Ain't that right?
all the cheeses that I'm using, and I think some of the crackers too, all came from Aldi's. All, actually, all the wines that I got as well. I don't think I showed you those. But anyway, yeah, all the cheeses and the meat too came from Aldi's. Do not sleep on Aldi's for your charcuterie -ch 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 board needs. <laughs> your charcuterie board needs. Aldi's is the place for your assorted crackers and for the low as well. And this is not a paid advertisement from Aldi's. I mean, we all love good Aldi's, yeah. Anyway, go ahead. Said you want a bad one Well, baby, I'm as bad as they come Said you want a hot one yeah. You with the hottest under the sun But be careful what you wish for Make you eat your words If I'm more than what you bargain for Fun to flirt But promise to deliver Much is required Cause look at what I'm giving you we really ready for real You ain't even ready for real Are you? You ain't really ready Ready? Won't be faithful to some One ungrateful I can't try to make you If you ain't you You ain't really ready for real want a real one well it don't get no realer than the realest one baby can you handle, handle me. if you really want it better come get you somebody careful what you wish for make you eat your word if i'm more than what you bargain for one dessert, dessert but you ain't finished in Grandson, oh, I love y'all so much. I don't know why I get so sad when y'all get ready to go and I'll be about to cry. And I will go in the house and cry. Here's 
I love you. I'm gonna be crying in a minute. I always get sad when y'all leave. <laughs> Love Come here, Artie. Give me hugs. Oh, Artie, give me hugs. Oh, Artie. Bitch, up in Maine. Oh, Artie. <laughs> 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 I love y'all. Thank y'all so much for coming. Thanks for suggesting it, Kwan, because it was actually your idea. Yeah. Love y'all girls. Uh -huh. Okay, Red, Piggy, Red. You trust him over here in the new whip? Now we in some car seats. Come, okay, what in the world? Get in these dirty seats. Get in your seats, boys. So we can strap. Now you both y'all can't get in that one seat, then. Then get in your seat. Don't pop. Okay, wait. Don't push. Wait a minute. Okay. Get, okay, wait a minute. Dean, get over that. No, day. This is not your seat, and you know it. <laughs> Stop! Uh uh! No no no! Wait! Wait! Please! Don't punch! Okay, wait, Dean. No, come on, come on. This is not yours. Come on, come on over this way. Yeah, come on, come on this way. Come on, no, Dean. This is not yours. Come on, get down, get down. Okay, come on. It's gotta go on the other side. Come on. Let me help you. Your brother tried to give you a sucker punch, didn't he? <laughs> Ooh. Okay, get in your seat, Solar. Like, hurry up. Get this footage because it was some punching going on in some faces. Or a chest or something that's so large. 